Folks, before we start, kindly hit the subscribe button and the notify button for new content that I upload weekly. Thank you. So Alaska is definitely a place uh, to eat seafood, and especially when you're in Anchorage, uh, you have a great number of restaurants uh, that serve quality seafood. So the first one we went to upon uh, arriving there was Bridge Seafood Restaurant. Uh, in fact, I was too hungry and jet lagged to actually film anything, but we had king crabs and copper river salmon, which was really delicious. And of course, there's a view of people fishing salmon as well from the restaurant. Uh, and then we actually went to uh, more of a, a brewery uh, for lunch. Uh, this is actually a place that if you want to get seafood, you can, uh, but I think it's more of a lunch spot. Uh, it's crowded, open kitchen, and of course, it's a brew house, so you have great uh, beers. And actually, they brew their root beer and cream soda as well for those people uh, looking for non-alcoholic libations. And the menu is a typical uh, spot bar menu. You get um, also cocktails in addition to beer. And in terms of the food, you have starters, uh, appetizers, you have uh, sandwiches, uh, you have uh, salads, as well as entrees uh, with a seafood heavy focus because we're in Anchorage. And the uh, interior is like a brew house. So what we ordered was, we actually ordered the appetizer tower consisting of garlic prawns, calamari, and Alaska smoked salmon. It's pretty good, decent food for lunch. Uh, the dinner, actually we went to a better place. It's called Saloon and Grill, and it's been around for over 40 years in Anchorage. Uh, the place is very beautiful. It's kind of like a train car, a classic train car. And the menu is consisting of uh, you know, really good seafood dishes. It's kind of like you go to a, a steak and seafood place uh, minus the steak. Uh, the seafood choices here are definitely impressive. Uh, they also have really good cocktails. So I got this cucumber elderflower smash. It's really refreshing for a summer day. Now the food here is amazing. So we had the oven roasted crab and artichoke dip, as well as the pan seared Alaskan halibut cheeks. The cheeks were uh, unique. I mean, in fact, the texture was more like crab meat, if you ask me. And the crab dip was really good as well. I mean, it's filled with lumps of crab meat, fresh crab meat. And of course, you can't really go wrong with a, an iceberg lettuce wedge. Um, and for the entree, uh, the other entrees we got, the pan seared halibut was just kind of blah. Uh, the scallop, the prawn and scallop fettuccine had a kick to it. The almond crusted sea scallop was disappointing, I have to say. And mushrooms are pretty good. So Ben, we're back here again. Uh, this is a really good Chinese place. If you want a king crab prepared with ginger and scallion, they do a really good one. Good alternative choice to eat some king crab uh, with minimal effort required with the way they chopped it up uh, so that we can actually have a great meal before we head back to New York. So, come with me. Hello. 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 So we were craving for carbs, so we started with some delicious pan fried rice noodles as well as the sauteed pork home style. The bacon here was cooked really well. Uh, the soup was really appetizing. It's a boiled sea bass in preserved cabbage soup. Uh, it's Szechuan style. And we had some string beans with minced pork as well. It's equally delicious. But of course, the highlight here being the Alaskan king crab in ginger sauce with scallions. Uh, the, we have had king crabs, you know, by now a few meals already, but this is definitely the easiest way to get to the meat without doing any work. You just have to use your chopstick and push it in from the other end and voila you have an amazing plum, tasty king crab. So let me demonstrate this for you again. So just use your chopstick, shove it in from the other end and just give it a little nudge without even using a lot of energy and boom, you have it. There you have it. Amazing king crab leg. So there you go. I mean, like we really enjoyed our meal here uh, at Jimmy's. In fact, we finished everything as you can see within an hour. Um, this is our highlight on where to eat uh, in Anchorage, Alaska.